morning everyone i'm pastor jimmy pickett and the verse i want to share with you today is matthew chapter 12 verse 37 it says for thy words thou shalt be justified meaning you shall be judged by the words and by thy words thou shalt be condemned uh folks people don't understand something do you not understand or no i hope you do but uh you know you will be judged man will be judged and there's no gender intended man woman child will be judged by every idle word that cometh out of your mouth and uh, if you've got a potty mouth today you might want to think real seriously about that that you will be judged by every idle word that come out of thy mouth and uh and it says for that by thy words you shall be justified you shall be judged well the thing about it is folks um if you it, now how can that be because if you deny god if you deny jesus christ and the holy spirit and, and, and with your mouth profess that you don't believe in them, then you will be condemned. You will be condemned to the pits and the fire of hell, folks. Uh, do you know the book of Proverbs says that the uh, that life and the power power of death and life are in, in the tongue? Uh, the things that come out of our mouths is by thy words thou shalt be condemned. Um, again, if you deny God and the Holy Spirit and Jesus Christ. Uh, but the thing about it is, guess what? On the opposite end of that, if you believe in Jesus Christ and God and the Holy Spirit of God, folks, and you accept him with the words that come out of your mouth and recognize that he died on that cross and in three days he rose again and through the blood of Jesus Christ that you will have eternal life. Uh, the other thing I want to say about this, you know, being judged by uh, every outer word, that, you know, in the walk sense, I mean, if you're a negative Nelly every day, well, I ain't never going to have nothing. I ain't never going to have a good job. I ain't never going to have a car. Uh, guess what? What comes out of your mouth, you put into action, folks. And you're right. You're not going to have anything. But now, if you if you have positive things come out of your mouth, man, when you get up in the morning and says, I am going to have a great day today. Man, look outside. The sun is shining, and it is absolutely beautiful. Oh, man, I know that what I've been praying for and that I've been hoping for, I know that God is going to answer that prayer, and those things are going to happen for me. You are professing and claiming victory when you do that. Life, life and death are in the power of the tongue. Hey, can I get an amen? Amen. Folks, if this has edified you today, hit your share button. Hit your share button. Um, God's children are starving to death for peace and hope in their lives today. Folks, we're now brought to you by your tithes and offering. Hey, if we've helped you, help us continue to come to you. Would you do that? Hey, me and my wife want to give a shout out to each and every person following our page. We love you guys so very much, and we're praying for you and your families each and every day. Hey, God bless you, and thank you for spending this time with me in the Holy Word of God.